parishes. Mm. You mention your mother quite often. And how, how do you want the world to receive your mother? I, I, I know you speak of her eloquently, but, but if you could summarize her and, and do you think that she gets her just due? You understand what I'm saying? Because she had she, she had to raise six women, six girls into women post Malcolm X murder, you know? That's right. And um, and I think she did a great job. You know, um, it had to have been difficult. My mother didn't let her us, her daughters, see her mm-hmm. traumatized because mm-hmm. she had to have been, mm-hmm. you know, she lived through a fight, the firebombing of her home with all of her babies and pregnant with twins. And then to see her husband gunned down in front of her and still go on and and pretend like she was OK to her girls. You know, my, I remember when I was in college and she came and I was getting a car. And I thought, you know, you just get the car and you 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 go, you know, like <laughs> like you go in the store, and you get a car, and you just leave. I didn't know you had to go to the uh-huh. motor vehicle, and you had to do all of these things. And so, I remember being online to do something at, um, you know, like at the cashier part. Mm-hmm. And when I turned to look at my mother, she was like almost hunched down, like she was exhausted. But when I looked at her, she immediately perked up with a straight back. You know, and so I'll never forget that now that I'm older to just think, my gosh, she went through hell. Mm. She went through freaking hell. Excuse me. She really went. Oh, you're in a barbershop. (laughs) You're comfortable. You're in the same place. (laughs) You know, she went through hell like 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 many of us. Uh And she did not want to see others Mm. have the same kind of pain that she had. So Mm. she was a very compassionate person. She was a very loving person. I understood when I wrote Betty before X, Mm -hmm. um, you know, the middle school book, I understood why my father chose her as his wife, Mm -hmm. you know, because they were both God fearing, great faith. And, um, and, you know, they read everything that you can imagine. And, you know, just, you know, really significant human beings. Beautiful. We got some comments from the people listening. Salute Fred. Great to see you. Yasha Shabazz in the barbershop. Letting you know you got family in here with you. I'm the oldest grandson of Bishop Charles Little. Me and my son enjoy your books. Oh. Hey, yeah. Yeah. Well, hey. You know, and so there are a lot of a lot of men in the Little family were, um, you know, bishops, reverends, ministers, men of, cl- of the cloth, including mm-hmm. my father um, mm-hmm. for Islam. Mm. Yeah. 